In this video I'll show how to set the accelerometer reference vector on the CHR6DM orientation sensor from CH Robotics. Um, the accelerometer reference vector is the expected output of the accelerometers when the pitch and roll angles are zero. Usually, um, under ideal circumstances, the expected output would be only uh, would be zero on the x and y axes and some negative value on the z-axis. Um, it happens, though, that sometimes after the HRS is mounted to, to whatever platform it's operating with, the, uh, there's some small misalignment. So that can be compensated for by setting the accelerometer reference vector. I'm already connected, as you can see, and we're getting data from the sensor. So I'm going to go ahead and the, uh, open the configuration dialog here and select the EKF tab and uh, go down and you can see here on the left hand side you can set the accelerometer reference vector. Uh, so the procedure is typically to mount the HRS on whatever device uh, it will be mounted on in the final product and then uh, set the pitch and roll angle to zero and then once it's set to zero which I've just done you go ahead and click the set Excel reference button and uh, you can see that the X and Y axes are slightly misaligned um, and uh, this feature allows you to compensate for that so uh, this uh, this feature does not allow you to drastically change what the expected zero pitch and roll angles should be so for example I couldn't rotate the sensor 90 degrees and then reset the accelerometer reference vector and expect it to still work properly this only compensates for small deviations in the uh, in the pitch and roll angles. Um, so after I've clicked the set Excel reference button, which we did earlier, um, those that new reference is written to RAM. If we want it to persist after the power is cycled, then we should click flash commit. And as you can see here, it sent a write to flash packet, and uh, the command was a success. So that's how to set the accelerometer reference vector on the CHR6DM AHRS.